Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, everyone. I hope you all must be doing good. So today, what I'm going to do, I have a Poco F3 GT mobile phone in my hand, and I will update Poco F3 GT from MIUI 13 to MIUI 14 and from Android version 12 to Android version 13. The Poco F3 GT can have the Redmi K40 Gaming MIUI 14 ROM on, on this mobile phone. And how to do that? We need to have an unlock bootloader first. The unlocking of bootloader is very easy. If you don't know how to do that, then you can simply watch that tutorial video. Link is provided in my video description. Unlock the bootloader. Simply follow further steps. You can get MIUI 14 on Poco F3 GT. And believe me, MIUI 14 China variant ROM is working very perfectly on Poco F3 GT. Unlock the bootloader first and uh, must turn off the lock screen password by going to the password security check the battery should be charged like maximum 40 to 50 percent and in case you are using me account sing your me account once remove it in case if you are definitely you will be using google account then sing your google account once and remove it and also you have to save all the internal storage data this procedure will format everything and uh, must have an unlock bootloader then you can get this rom so we need to download few files and you can simply power off the mobile phone right now if you show that your set bootloader is already unlocked this procedure requires data cable and uh, computer <music> If you are getting helped by these videos, do not forget to subscribe my channel and click the bell icon. Then click select all. Thank you so much. This is the downloaded folder where I have downloaded all the files. This particular Mi Flash Tool 2017 link provided in my video description. Download this file, then extract it must and open the extracted folder. Double click the Mi Flash file and install it on your Windows. This Mi Flash will flash the ROM file and also will install all the drivers automatically after the installation. This is the ROM file MIUI 14.0.2, the China variant ROM which can be easily flashed on POCO F3 GT. When you have download this ROM file then must extract it in same folder. But how to download this ROM file? Let me show you. The link is provided in my video description. When uh, clicking the link this website will get open Redmi K40 Gaming and POCO F3 GT. Right? Come down here and uh, you will see Redmi K40 Gaming China. So do not go for the public beta, do not go for the stable beta. You will have to go for the stable fast boot ROM file. Check Redmi K40 Gaming China st stable fast boot MIUI 14.0.2 yes and Android version 13. Then click on the download section here. The other page will get open. Come down here. Do not go for the recovery file. Go for the fast boot file just check yes fast boot redmi k40 gaming click the full rom the rom file will start downloading after the extracting the rom file open the extracted folder of rom you will see another folder inside after clicking this one must see the all the flashing files now go back once and copy this particular folder must copy this particular folder from here and Go to your main hard drive partition like C, D, E, F, whatever options you have. I will click on my C drive and I came out from the subfolder to my main drive hard drive partition that is C and I will paste that folder over here. And uh, when folder gets copied, double click on this folder, definitely you will see all the flashing files. Now moving towards my desktop screen. I can see that Xiaomi flash icon over here, double click the icon and then the click yes in on next window, the Xiaomi flash will get open. Now on Mi flash, click on select, then go to that main hard drive partition where I have copied my ROM folder. I have copied in my, that ROM folder in, on my C drive, click on C drive, yes, here we go. You can click and select this ROM folder, then click OK. Now Mi Flash is ready. We have to move towards the uh, mobile phone screen. Mobile phone must be power off and mobile phone bootloader must be 
unlock also we have to boot the set into fast boot mode for that uh, press and hold the volume down key and connect the cable but before check this other side of cable must be connected with computer press and hold the volume down key connect the cable set will boot into fast boot mode immediately release the volume down key yes release the volume down key set is booted into fast boot mode connected it with computer now coming back towards the mobile computer screen on me flash tool click refresh the me flash tool will detect the mobile phone yes but the important part which you don't have to miss is the default setting of me flash tool will be clean all and lock you don't have to relock the bootloader so click on clean all what it will do it will uh, flash the rom but the bootloader will remain unlocked which is must required to make the set work properly and uh, without any trouble without getting system destroyed you need to keep the bootloader remain unlocked until you are using the miui 14 china variant rom selecting the clean all then click flash and the flashing will start it it will take a time now all you have to do is to wait let the flashing complete then we will continue me flash tool will show success when flashing gets completed simply close the me flash tool when you see success and you are and we are done from the computer you will see a redmi logo now before it was poco logo basically poco f3 gt is converted to redmi k40 gaming when you see this redmi logo disconnect the cable from the mobile phone now all we have to do is to wait let the set start booting the first boot will take a little bit time when first boot completed then we will continue So finally first boot completed didn't took that much time now complete the setup screen but you will see miui 14 logo on your mobile phone this is the china variant rom so we are not getting that much uh, if, uh, languages and uh, after when you complete the uh, setup screen you will see the miui 14 launcher and definitely you will see me dialer having a call recording poco f3 gt was having a global rom which was having a, a google dialer and google messaging application but me ui 14 china variant will have google uh, sorry me dialer and uh, me sms now i will go on settings then my device definitely you will see that uh, the set is got updated from me ui 13 to me ui 14 and also updated from android 12 to android 13 and still you will see redmi k40 gaming you can simply change the name over here now this rom is having the google application but that is not prominent we have to enable something in this rom after flashing it so what we have to do is to after flashing the rom and after completing the set screen go to settings then scroll down go to account sync and if i tap add account you will see there is no google option here go back simply tap google basic basic google services and turn it on and go back and now tap add account and you will see google option is there now you can connect the wi-fi and simply log in your google account one more step because the play store is not here we have to update the play store and for that first of all connect the wi-fi or even if you are having a mobile data turn it on when wi-fi got connected then go back and on main screen see get apps tap to open the get apps application tap agree and type on search bar g double o g l e type google on search bar then scroll down and select google having a chinese language the second one if you see this on first then you can simply tap it but you have to tap the google after tapping the google you will see many many applications scroll down and look for the google play store just scroll down here we go you can see that google play store is over here then tap on the google play store then tap update and which will make the google play store to start updating just wait for it let the updating complete then we will continue so finally google application got updated i will minimize this application and on next 
page you will see google play store if you tap the google play store and if you are already having a google account login on your mobile phone definitely you will see all the application on google play store you can start downloading all your requires application but in case if you are not having a google account simply tap sign in sign in your google account and start using your google play store so the the miui 14 is uh, flashed very perfectly on poco f3 gt and a uh, few applications that are not required if you do not want that you can simply keep tapping it and uninstall it the, uh, the, this is the way you can install all your that application which you don't want to be on your mobile phone so poco f3 gt is converted to redmi k40 gaming and also poco f3 gt is updated to miui 14 do not forget to like the video take a good care of yourself we'll see you in my next video until then goodbye